Hello, we're on to match day number 22 at in the Sky Bet Championship. But first, let's have a look back at week 21 matches and see how myself and the football simulator got around because we're the only ones that got involved and made our predictions. But feel free to join the series, a number of people have, just not consistently getting involved. So, first up was Bristol City, they were 2 1 winners against Wickham Wanderers with Martin and Dela Hulu getting the goals there for Bristol City, we had Matt Cleary getting the goal for Wickham Wanderers. 13 to 9 shots for Wickham, and we had 4 to 1 on target for Bristol City in the end. Nottingham Forest and Burnham played at a 0 0 star mate. 14 to 8 shots for Nottingham Forest and 6 to 3 on target. Preston North End 1 0 winners against Derby County. After Ray Corn got sent off for Derby County very early on in this game, in the 20th minute, had a dramatic 96 minute winner from Brian for Preston. 9 to 5 shots and 4 to 1 on target for themselves. Barnsley 2 1 winners against Huddersfield with Helic scoring the two goals, including a stoppage time winner as well. After Huddersfield opened the scoring with Edmunds Green to kick things off. Swansea, they won this Welsh derby battle against QPR. 2 0 winners, Ayu and Lowe scoring the goals. 12 to 6 shots for QPR, 4 to 1 on target for Swansea. Reading 2 1 winners against Luton Tarn including Mick and Terry and Semedo for Luton Tarn. Lula Lula got a stoppage time consolation goal. Eight to four shots for Luton Tarn, three to two on target as well. We had Brentford 3-2 winners against Cardiff with Canos getting a hat-trick. We had Votes scoring the two goals there for Cardiff. 16 to six shots for Brentford. We had seven to three on target too. Next up was Blackburn Rovers and Sheffield Wednesday, a 1-1 draw. With Weech scoring the goal there for Sheffield, we had Wathwell scoring for Blackburn to equalise. 16 to 7 shots, 4 to 1 on target for the home side. Commentary and Stoke City, a 0-0 star mate. Stoke with more of the opportunities, 11 to 7 on the shots, 2 to 1 on target for Coventry. And finally Watford, 1-0 winners against Norwich. With Saar getting the match winner, 39th minute in. 16 to 7 shots for Norwich and 3 to 1 on target. So how do we get on with our predictions? I can say that uh, the football sniper did slightly better this time round, picking up 8.9. With the likes of Barnsley, Bristol City, Brentford and Preston North End to win the games. For myself it was 7.72 with Bristol City to win as well as a couple of draw matches, the Coventry Stoke City draw and the Northampton Burnham draw. Overall leaderboard sees the football simulator winning away with things for 194.15. Got myself in second, 158.8. Carver White in third, 46, uh, 43.62. As a emergency in fourth, 23.08. And fifth is Spirit Dice, 14.61. Robert Hollis in fifth position. In 6th position, 13.25, and Tom Owen 7th for 5.92. As we head on to match day number 22. First up, we've got Burnham taking on Derby County. We have 48 wins for Derby County, 40 victories for Burnham, and 36 draws. Derby with 6 wins and 2 draws coming in the past 8 matches. Burnham at $2.63, 3 bucks for the draw, and $2.74 for, $2 for Derby County. Should look at the table there to see, just to tell you where about say at, uh, at, at the moment. So we have uh, Burnham in 17th, 5 wins, 8 draws, 8 defeats this season. Picking up a win and a draw in the past 5 matches. Meanwhile for Derby County, they are in 22nd, 3 wins, 7 draws, 10 defeats, 2 wins and 2 draws in the past 5 games. So things are looking up there for Derby County. Gonna go off Derby, 2 1 winners. The football summator is gonna go off Derby County, 1 0 victors. Got Sheffield Wednesday taking on Millersburg, 48 to 47 victories in favour of Sheffield Wednesday on this one, and 18 draws. Two wins each, and a draw in the past five games. As for this match, we got $3.50 for Sheffield Wednesday, $3 for the draw, and $2.10 for Millersburg. Sheffield Wednesday comes to us in 23rd position, 4 wins, 7 draws, and 10 losses. One victory and a draw in their past five matches. Meanwhile for Middlesbrough, they are up into eighth spot. Nine wins, six draws, five defeats. Three victories coming in the past five games for themselves here. Going to go with a 1-1 one, one draw. The football simulator is going to go with Sheffield Wednesday, 2-1 winners.
Norwich, they take on QPR. 49 victories for Norwich, 41 wins for QPR, and 55 draws. Norwich, four wins in the past five games. Norwich, big favourites here at $1.53. We got $3.75 for the draw and $5.50 for QPR. Norwich comes to us, top of the table, 13 wins, 4 draws, 4 defeats. Picking up 4 victories in the past 5 games. Meanwhile for QPR in 19th, winless in their past 5 games. 4 wins, 8 draws, 9 defeats this season. Picking up 3 draws in their past 5 matches. So I've got to go with Norwich on this one, a 2-0 victory. The football science is going to go up a 1-1 draw. Next game is Huddersfield as they take on Blackburn. 33 wins for Blackburn, 24 wins for Huddersfield. And we got 34 draws. Huddersfield, 2 wins and 6 draws in the past 8 games. Huddersfield comes to us in 14, 8 wins, 4 draws, 9 defeats. Picking up 2 wins and a draw in the past 5 matches. Meanwhile for Blackburn Rovers, they are in 11th, 8 wins, 5 draws, 8 defeats. Just the one victory and a draw in the past five matches for themselves here. So with this one, Blackburn are the favourites. Away from home against Huddersfield, but I'm going to go with a 1-1 draw. And the football says it's going to go up a 3-0 victory for Huddersfield. Next up sees Luton Tan take on Bristol City. 22 wins for Bristol, we got 20 wins for Luton and we got 17 draws. Luton 5 wins and 3 draws in the past 9 games. Luton comes to us as the favourites at $2.20, $3.20 for the draw and $3.10 for Bristol City. Luton Tarn, they are in, in 15th on the table, 7 wins, 6 draws, 8 defeats, picking up a victory and 2 draws in the past 5 games. Meanwhile for Bristol City, they are situated in ninth spot, 10 wins, 3 draws, 8 defeats, 2 wins in the past 5 games for themselves here. Going to go for Luton Tarn, 2-1 winners. The football side is going to go Bristol City to win 2-1 instead. Next game we got Wotherham taking on Barnsley. 21 wins for Barnsley, 17 wins for Wotherham and 14 draws. Barnsley with 6 wins and 3 draws in the past 9 games. Also this match we got $2.88 for Wotherham. We got $3.20 for the draw and $2.30 for Barnsley. Wotherham comes to us in 21st. 4 wins, 4 draws, 11 losses. Just the one victory in the past five games here. Meanwhile for Barnsley, they come into us in 10th. Nine wins, four draws, eight defeats, four wins in the past five games. Very impressive stuff. Going to go Barnsley, 3-2 winners. The football side is going to go up a 3-3 draw. So expect the goals in this match here. Next game, we've got Preston off end taking on Coventry. 16 wins for Preston, 10 wins for Coventry and 14 draws, Preston off end, 2 wins and 3 draws in the past 5, or 7 wins and 6 draws in the past 14. Preston off our end, other favourites at $2.10, $3.20 for the draw, $3.30 for Coventry. Preston coming to us in 13th, 9 wins, 2 draws, 10 defeats, picking up 3 wins in the past 5 games. Meanwhile for Coventry, they are situated in, in 18th, with 5 wins, 8 draws, 8 defeats, 1 victory and 3 draws in the past 5 games for themselves. Going to go off the host, Preston North End, to come through 2 nil winners. The football side is going to go off a 2-2 draw. Next up we've got Wickram Wanderers taking on Cardiff. 6 wins for Cardiff, 3 wins for Wickram and 1 draw. Cardiff winning the past 4 matches back to back. Wickram got it all to do, $4.00. Four to win at home here, $3.40 for the draw, $1.83 for Cardiff. Wickham Wanderers are the bottom team in the league, just the two wins all season, six draws, 13 defeats. But what do you expect from them? They're still within a chance of somehow staying in this division, and that will be still quite a big achievement if they're able to do that. Uh, past five games, just the one draw for themselves. Meanwhile for Cardiff, they're in 12th, just the two wins in the past five games with eight wins, five draws, eight defeats for the season. Going to go with Cardiff to win this match, three goals to one. The football side is going to go with a 3 nil shutout. Next up is Stoke City taking on North Nottingham Forest. So we've got 45 wins for Nottingham Forest, 32 wins for Stoke, and 31 draws. Two wins each and a draw in the past five games. Stoke City are the favourites here at $2.30, $3 for the draw, $3.20 for Nottingham Forest. Stoke City, they come into this in 7th, 
9 wins, 7 draws and 5 defeats. 1 victory and 3 draws in the past 5 games for Stoke. Meanwhile, Nottingham Forest are win at 20th. 4 wins, 6 draws, 11 defeats. Picking out 1 win and 2 draws in the past 5 games for themselves here. Going to go with a 1-1 draw. The football side is going to go with Stoke to win this match. A goal to nil. Next up we've got Brentford taking on Bournemouth. 41 victories for Brentford, 38 wins for Bournemouth and 31 draws. Bournemouth 2 wins and 3 draws in the past 6 matches. Brentford are the favourites at $2.40, $3.20 for the draw and $2.80 for Bournemouth. Brentford, they come into this in 4th position. 10 wins, 8 draws and 3 defeats. 3 wins and 2 draws in the past 5 games for Brentford. Meanwhile, they're taking on 3rd place Bournemouth. So this is a big key matchup there. So Bournemouth, they got 10 wins, 8 draws and only 2 losses this season. Picking up 3 wins and 2 draws in the past 5 games for themselves. I'm going to go for a 2-2 draw. It's a difficult match to call, so I've gone in the middle. The football side is just going to go off a 1-0 win for Bournemouth. Next up is my championship club at in the championship, Ben Swansea, taking on a wedding. So we've got 33 victories each and 15 draws. Swansea 8 wins and 5 draws in the past 13. Odds for this match, we got Swansea as the favourites at $2. $3.20 for the draw and $3.50 for wedding. Swansea comes this in second, 11 wins, 6 draws, 4 defeats, 3 wins and a draw in the past 5 games. Meanwhile for Wedding in 6th position, 11 wins, 3 draws and 7 defeats. 2 victories to go along with 3 defeats in the past 5. Going to go with a big convincing victory there for Swansea. And who knows, maybe even a potential automatic promotion spot at this stage in time. Going to go Swansea, 3-0 winners. The Football Science is going to go off a 2-0 win for Wedding. And we conclude match day number 22's predictions with Millwall taking on Watford. 42 wins for Millwall, 32 wins for Watford and 27 draws. Watford 3 wins and a draw in the past 5 games. Millwall $2.75 at home, $3.25 for the draw and $2.40 for Watford. Millwall comes to this in 16th with 5 wins, 10 draws and 5 defeats. 1 victory and 2 draws in the past 5 games. Meanwhile, for Watford, they come as us in 5th with 10 wins, 7 draws, 4 defeats, picking up 3 victories and a draw in the past 5 matches here. I'm going to end things off with a win for Watford, a 3-1 victory. The football side is going to go with a 3-0 win instead, but still for Watford, has to be said. So that concludes match day's number 22's predictions at in the Sky Beach Championship. Feel free to get involved with your own thoughts, predictions down in the comment section below, and then we'll shall all compare how we get on this time around there. Thanks for watching, check out the other videos, because they come thick and fast at this moment in time. Cheers.